Officials of the National Primary Health Care Development Agency, the World Health Organization, and UNICEF are giving journalists updates on Nigeria's COVID vaccination exercise, the Delta variant, and the fear of a third wave. After four months of vaccine rollout in Nigeria, the country says it has administered 98% of the 4 million and 20,000 doses of AstraZeneca it received from the COVAX facility in March this year. But the country is now ending its first vaccination phase owing to vaccine inadequacy amidst the emergence of the deadly Delta variant and fear of a third wave. The country has officially ended the first phase of its strategic COVID-19 vaccination plan and is now preparing to commence the second phase in the next few weeks. A lot of Nigerians came forward despite all of the negative uh, conspiracy theories and accepted the vaccines. This is why we were able to ramp up and finish the vaccines and we did not have any vaccines expire. Nigeria has relatively kept COVID-19 infection and fatality rates low since the outbreak of the virus in the country last year. So far, over 1 million cases have been reported, leading to over 2,000 fatalities. But the emergence of the Delta variant in the country and the resurgence of cases across Africa is now another source of concern. We must be mindful of discontinuing public health and social measures. Leaping them too early could see us losing some of the gain that the vaccine have enabled us to make. The pandemic is still here and we must take measures to ensure that we prevent its further um, expansion around the country, but also we take the measures to ensure that the next phase of the vaccination campaign is success, equally successful. COVID-19 vaccination is currently the main pharmaceutical intervention against the pandemic globally, which is why many want the Nigerian government to do all it can to acquire these life-saving preparations against the virus.